And here, guys, is one of the cars that we've been uh, previewing for you and looking ahead to on a number of occasions this week. It's the 1970 Dodge Hemi Coronet. Yet another big car from this year. 426 Hemi, there it is. Yeah, something about a Hemi. Instantly identifiable, probably the most recognizable performance engine that came out of the 1960s. Uh, came out in street form in 66, went away in 1971. Super rare in a 70 Cornet RT. In fact, only one of four speeds, one of these were built with a four speed, and this is the very first one of those that were built. Fully documented, and hey, Bill Stevens, guess who built the engine back in 2000? How about no other than drag racing Mopar our legend dandy dick landy yep that's you know what that's got to add to the value of that car as well dick landy what a legend he's getting all the trivia questions right today so <laughs> two hundred thirty five thousand dollar bid no surprise we predicted multiple six-figure bidding on this particular car we've got a couple of other contenders coming up as well the reserve is off the reserve is off here, guys. 240. 270. That's Tim Phillips there with Frank Meekham. John, it looks great on television, but it is something to behold in person. Reserve came off at 235, I think. Wow. $300,000, rare Hemi. Predicted big bidding, and we sure got it. It paid off. I think everybody's yeah. happy on that one. Yeah, the Hemi market is white hot right now. We sold that Hemi Cuda convertible in Seattle for 3.5. Right. Yeah. This car. Uh, people were asking me what I thought this car would do. I said yeah. six figures depends on who's in the room. Exactly. What happens, you never really know. But 300,000. I gotta you ask. Go. I gotta ask you guys if you're the consigner that brought this car in. Obviously, hoping and expecting six figures. Would you have been surprised at over 300? You never know. That's the thing. Yeah. You know, there's no real way of knowing how high the bid is going to go. But you know you got something special. That's yep. the thing. So you hope that the bidders appreciate what you've got. Well, that has raised the bar and set the bar for all the cars to follow it here today. And we'll see if there are other contenders for that top spot. Right now, it's number 